In Park City, a Black Lives Matter mural there destroyed overnight. Jenna Rose in Park City, where some residents are calling it a hate crime, while others say it shouldn't have been there to begin with. If you look behind me, you can see what's left of the mural that was painted here over the weekend by a local artist. Now, many people in Park City are sad to see it destroyed, but some say it shouldn't have been here to begin with. From the balcony of Tequila Cantina, as people enjoy their lunch, owner J.C. Martinez... I cannot even believe it. ...is distracted by the stain on the street below. It's a hate crime, in my own opinion. He watched all weekend as artist LJ Fui Maono painted Black Lives Matter across the street. It was a project through the Summit County Arts Council, who received a grant through the city. He spent two days doing it. But this morning, J.C. got to work to find the word black and the fist of the eye covered in gray paint. Uh, that hurts. You know what I mean? I mean, again, you, you, they just come over to the lead black. That means like it's like the leading Hispanic or Mexican or Latino, the same thing. As a Mexican-American, JC says he's personally offended and calls this a display of hate. But just across the street, another man thinks differently of it. I don't really agree with their message. <laughs> it should be about all lives. Aaron Semerel is an inspirational speaker, sharing his message at a local art gallery. I think that all lives do matter. It, it is disrespectful to come and mess up somebody's art like that. However, I think that is a clear point and a message that needs to come across. Both men of color, but with different perspectives. But what they can agree on is that Park City is a place of love. People around here is from everywhere around the world. Just treat everyone with love and respect and kindness and we'll all get along and do fine. We reached out to Park City Police Department to see if they would be filing any charges and so far haven't heard back from them, but we did hear back from the city. They gave us a statement which reads in part, painting over the Main Street murals last night was an act of petty vandalism and now becomes a part of Park City's history. We will use this event to further our community's dialogue about social inequities. In Park City, Jenna Rowe, 2 News.